Did you know that it is estimated in the United States, one out of every eight people will be affected by breast cancer? For some, it may be themselves, a friend, a spouse, a relative. For me, it was my mother. I'm Kalia Smithman. Coming up, we'll see how the city of Birmingham is raising awareness and money for breast cancer research. On October 17th, thousands gathered at Lynn Park in downtown Birmingham for the Susan G. Coleman Race for the Cure. The day started with a survivor's parade. followed by the 5K run and the one mile walk run. With many people present, there was one part that stood out to many. When we got there, I really wasn't expecting the parade of survivors. And my friend that is a cancer survivor asked me to uh, walk the parade with her. And I never really expected the emotion from the crowd and the cheering and the screaming and the hollering for all these ladies who were breast cancer survivors. There were many vendors present with food and water for the runners. Informational booths located around Lynn Park help people learn about breast cancer and the importance of early detection. It is estimated that there will be over 200,000 new cases of breast cancer and over 40,000 breast cancer deaths in this year alone. Health experts say there are some genetic markers that can make a person more likely to have breast cancer, but there's never any way to know for sure. However, there are some things you can do to prevent it. Managing your overall health, including your weight, physical activity, and diet can play a part. And doctors agree, early detection is the key. Earlier detection um, tests such as the MRI, which I do, um, were able to catch even further um, advancement so that the treatment options can be, you know, a little bit more successful. Caught soon enough, their survival rate is near 100%. Reporting for Falcon Weekly, I'm Kalia Smitherman.